Hey everyone, it's Ray with the channel Love Water Healing and I'm coming to you today to give you a reading for January 14th, 2021 uh, for the collective and we're going to do the Earth Magic Oracle cards. I'm really starting to love, love, love these cards and um, a lot of my clients are as well so we're going to use those today. So let's get a message for the collective for January 14th, 2021. Hope everyone's doing well. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos. I hope that they bring you a little bit of solace and calm uh, in the challenging times and a little challenging energy we have ourselves, but I promise it's going to look up and everything is going to start to <sighs> relax and calm down, right? <clears throat> Sometimes you just have to take those deep breaths in order to move through. Okay, well, we've got a card for the collective. This is a really beautiful card because this talks exactly what I was just saying. Um, and this card is called Clouds. And you can see those beautiful clouds coming down from the sky. And the main theme is shape-shifting. So at this time, it's an opportunity for you to look at your life and really start on the 14th to start to shape and create your reality. What exactly are you looking to do in your life? What brings you passion and joy? Um, and start to just do it. Like I'm just doing these YouTube videos and this is what I really love doing. I love doing cards uh, for people and I'm just gonna continue to make YouTube videos. Whatever comes of it, comes of it, but it brings me joy. And so because of that, I am putting out a goal that I can do at least one YouTube video for five days in a week, every single week for you guys. So here's what we got. We've got clouds. Let's see what it says in the earth magic about clouds and shape shifting. It's going to be a big time for us to start changing a lot of things in our lives. And this is a perfect card on the for the 14th of January to really start moving through. We are in a new moon phase. And so this is the time for you to also start creating, writing affirmations for things that you want not only to come to fruition, say, tomorrow, but also come to fruition two weeks from now and for the next six months. Because this is a powerful new moon. <clears throat> it's the first of the year and it's in Capricorn. So beautiful. Okay, it says, when tiny droplets of water or frozen crystals are surrounded by billions of other droplets or crystals, a cloud is formed. Each of these tiny droplets diffuse and scatter light so that the drop, so that the tops of the clouds are white, then fade to gray toward the base. The nature of cloud formations affect our mood as well as temperature on the ground and in the air. Their shape movement and coloration tell us what weather to expect and, a near, and in the near future. And they nourish our visual hunger during breathtaking sunrises and sunsets. Most of us have had an opportunity at one time or another to notice the shapes and forms clouds take as they drift gently or boldly across the sky, constantly shifting and changing adjusting themselves to the requirement of their nature. When we take time to simply observe, we can see that the cloud people, images that are elegant collaboration between nature and our imagination. In both subtle and more dramatic ways, you can shape shift by your choice of clothing, hairstyle, adornments, and even mannerisms such as facial expressions, gestures, and the way you walk. By adjusting these along with your internal attitude, number one, internal attitude, right? That's the intention, is that you want not only what's showing on the outside to be reflective, but also what you're feeling on the inside. You can actually display different personas. <clears throat> when you experiment with these variations of self-expression that are not how you ordinarily present yourself, others will react to you. Depending on the degree in which your persona contrasts with the one you are most familiar with. Be like the clouds as you try out different forms, stretching your limits at times, willing to move and adjust as necessary. Lift your head up, square your shoulders, stand tall such that your chest and heart open to the world and note how this feels. May you feel vulnerable at first, you may feel vulnerable at first, but stay with it. Then let your shoulders fall forward slightly. 
Pull your chest inward an inch or two and let your head drop a little and observe how this feels. Experiment with contrasting or contracting, contracting your aura, your energy field, and then expand it as far as you comfortably can. By this kind of shape shifting, you can concisely choose your expression into the world. Just remember who you are at the core. Oh, that's a beautiful thing to be able to do, to just expand your energy field, right? And feel that aura, that energy being pushed out of you. And then it, you see how it feels when you are slinked down and your head is down a little bit, how that feels like it's an inward push. You're pushing your energy back into your body. This is really powerful. And this is awesome for the perfect card for around the new moon. So it says experiment with contracting your aura, then expand it as far as you comfortably can. This is a great experiment or something you can do to just relax your body. Um, you can sit in a chair. You can even lay in a bed and do it um, and practice yourself pushing your chest out, squaring your shoulders, taking a deep breath, pushing it out, and then see how that feels. See the energy pushing out of your body. And then take a moment, curl back into yourself, take your chest in a little bit, put your shoulders down, see how that feels, take a deep breath into it. It's not as expansive. So this is a great way also for you just to chill out and relax, um, but it also gives you the opportunity that if you are feeling tired during the day, you can sit and do this um, actual, <clears throat> exercise and as you're expanding your aura out you're opening up and you're able to uh, bring energy right from source or from god or from you know the earth into your body to fill you up and it will actually physically wake you up um, that's awesome thank you so much for watching i really appreciate you coming to my channel uh, as always love your water and love yourself I love you all. Thank you so much, and I will talk to you soon. Bye for now.